What's up, movie crew? So welcome to the latest unboxing. Before I get started, if you are new to this channel, my name is Luke, this is Let's Watch a Movie, and if you're in anything cinema and physical media related, you've come to the right place, so hit that subscribe button. Emphasis on please hitting that subscribe button at 1,000 subscribers. I will be doing a five steelbook giveaway. All right, without further ado, I got this in from A24, as you can tell. For those that are new to this channel, I am an A24 All Access member or AAA24. And one of the perks of being an A24 All Access member is that you get the zines for part of your membership. I will have a pinned comment down below for the A24 All Access signing up. It is $5 a month. You get some pretty decent stuff if you're an A24 fan. And I will also have my playlist of the A24 videos I have done in the past. But without further ado, it is time to open this thing up. Okay, I am seriously having some issues here. And we have issue number 20, all about Brendan. So I recently saw The Whale in theaters after it went back to theaters in honor of it getting a couple Oscar nominations. And I gotta say, it is one of his best performances. It was a very emotional movie. I will have that review in the pinned comment down below for anyone that wants to hear my thoughts on that movie. So, there is the front where you get pictures of Brendan Fraser in various movies of his over the years. And then there is the back. Honk, if you'd rather be watching the 1999 cinematic masterpiece, The Mummy, starring Brendan Fraser and Rachel Weisz. So I'm not gonna show off too much of the inside because I had a copyright issue with that before. A24, if y'all wanna like, you know, not get me in trouble, I will be more than happy to show these off more in depth. But the entire scene is focused on Brendan Fraser. It starts off with a letter of sorts written by Darren Aronofsky. He is the director of Black Swan and Requiem for a Dream. He also directed The Whale. And then you've got various screenshots over the years of Brendan Fraser. And you've got some of him meeting fans at Comic-Cons. Definitely been in some legacy stuff, so obviously he's going to be talking about The Mummy. Me personally, I'm sure I'm not the only person that would be asking about the TV show he's recently in called Doom Patrol, which is wrapping up its fourth and unfortunately final season where he plays Robot Man. But his most recent cinematic outing was The Whale, which was made by A24 directed by Darren Aronofsky, and it is nominated for some Oscars. So congrats on that. But that is the main thing you get in here. You get a lot of stuff just pretty much highlighting the amazing career that this man has had and the recent resurgence he has had in his career. If you were not an A24 all Access member, you can buy this on the A24 Shop website. Again, link will be in the pinned comment down below for anyone that wants to check that out. And if you are not an A24 All Access member, but you do like A24 stuff, I highly recommend signing up for the service. $5 a month, you get the zines that are every quarter, you get discounts on various stuff, you get a free gift on your birthday. 
And every so often you even get a free ticket for various movies. I got to see Bodies, Bodies, Bodies for free and had it been in my area, I was even given a free ticket for the inspection. So highly recommend checking that out. And then to A24, I am looking forward to sitting down and checking out what you have in this particular zine. And that's going to do it for this one. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. You like what you see, leave a thumbs up. Comment down below. Have you seen The Whale? What would you think of it? What is your favorite Brendan Fraser performance? As I am still kind of biased towards Doom Patrol being a comic book fan and loving all the craziness on that show. But I know a lot of people are probably going to say The Mummy. Makes sense. But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching and tune in next time.